welcome back to Bass Box and Outdoors. Uh, today we're going to be doing a little unboxing. Uh, and what I mean by little unboxing is I mean a big unboxing. Uh, so this is going to be a pretty long video, just to let you know ahead of time. Uh, but anyways, so uh, anyways, the other day I was on Amazon and I was just looking around at fishing stuff and I noticed that 13 fishing had a sale going on or something. I don't know what it, what, what it was, but anyways, they had their baits on sale, like all their uh, plastics on sale for certain colors between a dollar and three dollars. So I was sitting there, I was clicking on each one and each one these certain colors would be like, you know, anywhere between a dollar and three dollars. So I racked up on them. I went through there and, you know, I went through every bait they had and I selected all these colors. And they're not bad colors. That's what I don't understand. You'd look at it, like you'd click on it and say, like the Ninja Tail Worm, it would say it would be five ninety nine. You'd click on it and then you'd go and bring up the page and then it would have a bunch of colors on the bottom. And then you'd select a color and look at it, and it would say a dollar ninety nine or three ninety nine or whatever price it was. So, anyways, I wanted to let y'all in on this little secret. So, right now on Amazon, Thirteen Fishing has their stuff real cheap for certain colors only. Okay. Uh, so, anyways, I'm gonna show y'all what I got, and. The total price that I ended up spending for all this stuff was about $50. And this is the box I got. And it's full all the way to the top. So I ended up spending about $50. I love 13 fishing stuff. Uh, what I'm assuming happened is 13 fishing these certain colors on these certain baits didn't sell very well so they're trying to get rid of them so like i said if you want to get in on this deal you might want to hop up hop on over to amazon and start looking at the 13 fishing i mean even like their uh their frogs they're on sale some of them uh their crank baits all kinds of stuff every bit of it's on sale but like i said it's only on certain colors uh but if you've never tried 13 fishing stuff and you want to try now would be the time because like i said you can get it for dirt cheap uh so that's just a little heads up and if you ain't ever fished with 13 fishing stuff you need to because it works really good like i said i think the reason why these certain colors are on sale like that is because they didn't sell very well so they're trying to get rid of them so anyways i hopped on i've even got more than this coming i've still got stuff coming left and right from 13 fishing so go on to amazon type in 13 fishing baits look at them see you might want to order some like i said if you ain't ever tried 13 fishing now would be the time <clears throat> let me get a drink real quick So anyways, thanks for all the comments, thanks for all the likes, thanks for all the subscribes. I really appreciate it. And uh, I think we're only like nine away from doing that real giveaway this weekend, probably Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. We might just do it on Sunday. I'm gonna go ahead and announce the winner for the 400 subscriber giveaway. And then the next week will be the every other Sunday giveaway and hopefully by then maybe we'll be at 450 and then we'll do that real so anyways let's dive in on into, into this and the reason why it's going to take so long is because i've got different colors of each bait and i'm going to show them to you that way maybe you don't get on there and you see it and be like man that color don't look that good or whatever okay so like I said, this is going to be a kind of a long video, but anyways, first up, we got the Caboose Crawl, and uh, this is in uh, Boss Nugget. This is one of my favorite colors by them, Boss Nugget, 
and uh, the length of this is four inches long makes a good trailer uh, or you can fix you know fish it uh, Texas rig shaky head or something like that and it weighs three eighths of an ounce and there's six of these in here see that was another thing I was wondering about I thought maybe they were damaged or something like that but there's nothing wrong with them they're perfect and they're full packs so anyways here's this little bad boy and as you can see that that's a real nice color and uh, got them big old flappers on it and I will say this these are all these are a little bit more oily than the ones that I originally get from most other stores I don't know why but it seems like they've got a lot of uh, scent to them uh, but anyways like you can see there's your little flapper down there on the bottom it's got that little hook keep the hook guard thing where the hook pops out so these are not double sided so uh, just keep that in mind but anyways you get six of them in a pack and see I don't know if y'all can see that but all that oil that's that donkey sauce is what they call it uh, works real good and like I said you get six of them they stack them in there on top of each other and this right here is a newer packaging style than what they normally go with normally their packages are real real long and I'll show you here in a minute whenever we get to some different ones but uh, but anyways that's the boss nugget next up this is the OG sour and this is basically like a watermelon uh, so watermelon red is basically what that's like and uh, another thing that's real nice about this is right there at the end of the mouth I don't know if y'all can see it but it's actually kind of hollow so what happens is whenever it sinks it lets a bunch of bubbles out which I think kind of cool so anyways that's the OG sour and these are called the caboose crawl and I think I ended up paying two dollars a piece for these like I said I didn't go over three dollars on any of this most of it was two dollars and uh, so yeah I thought that was pretty cool this one right here is called a moldy orange and this is more of a natural crawfish color as you can see real nice I like them like I said if you ain't ever fished with 13 fish and stuff you need to give it a shot they work real good Like I said, I just don't really like the way they do their clam shells. Uh, if they did it like this, that wouldn't be bad with every one of them, but they don't. Like I said, a lot of them are big and bulky. Uh, I've actually taken a lot of mine out of the clam shells and just stuck them in my tackle box and uh, did it that way because really a lot of this stuff you don't really even need any clam shells. So anyways, that's your uh, caboose crawl. Uh, next up is the ninja crawl. This one is uh, PB and J time. Uh, three inches, three eighths of an ounce. They didn't have a lot of these on sale, so I wasn't able to pick up a lot of these. I, don't, I think this was the only one I was able to pick up. These are neat little crawls. You can use these on a uh, like a little uh, net head, and that'll work really good. 
or you could use it as a trailer for a chatterbait or something. But their PB and J look pretty cool. It's got a lot of blue in it. Like I said, you can tell right there, it's got a lot of blue and red. And then on the other side, it's kind of a brown, darker color. But anyway, that's uh, the Ninja Crawl and uh, PB and J. Next up is uh, the Jerk. And this is a glitter bomb, and it's five inches long and uh, seven sixteenths of an ounce. They didn't have these on sale very well either. But this is kind of their take on a fluke, and it's like it's got rabbit ears on it. So it's like a, like I said, you fish it just like you would a fluke, or you could put a belly weighted hook on it. And it swims real good through the water like that. But there's that glitter bomb. Real nice color. It's got a lot of uh, glitter in it. And then it's got your little slot for your hook. And like I said, you got these little kickers down here that them things flap all over the water. Really good. You like fluke fishing, you'll like fishing that. You fish it the same way. A lot of people put them on belly weighted hooks because they do have a real, real good kick action that way. So like I said, that was the jerk and that was the glitter bomb. Next up is uh, my name's Jeff and this one was in glitter bomb. And uh, this is a four inch and one fourth of an ounce. There you go. Y'all can see that pretty good through there. I'm not going to worry about taking them out. If I have to take all of them out, it's going to take forever to do this video. And then you can see on top. But anyway, glitter bombs, real nice color. And this right here is going to make a real good net head, uh, a drop shot. Any of your finesse style type fishing, this is going to work real good. Next up. Uh, we have uh, the Vertigo Minnow, and this is in uh, Melanchi. This one's four, four inches long, uh, one seventh of an ounce. And this is more of like a green pumpkin. And this is, uh, I will take one of these out. It's like a green pumpkin gold because it does have a lot of gold flake in it. And uh, like I said, it's flat. So you can use this as a trailer. This right here is a real good drop shot bait. Because it's got that, the way that tail acts and kicks through the water. Really good bait. And like I said, that color is the Melanche, and uh, it's called the Vertigo Minnow. Uh, that one's the same color. All right, here's a uh, OG Sour. And this is the Vertigo Minnow as well. Real neat looking little color. And see here's their tail. Little bitty small tail on it. And I tell you, I bet you on the back of a uh, chatterbait or something that would work real good too. Because it's flat, it's not big and bulky. And that was the OG Sour. 
And once again, the vertigo minnow. Uh, next up, we got the BFF Blunt Force Finesse. This is in a pimp and purple. Uh, six and a half inches long, weighs a fourth of an ounce. And basically, this right here is just a uh, like a watermelon with purple flake in it. I'm not going to bother taking these out because y'all know what finesse worms look like. This is their, uh, basically their trick worm. Uh, this is the same color. I love their pimp and purple. And uh, like I said, six and a half inches long. They do have different sizes of these baits as well, just to let you know. All right, now this right here is probably one of my favorites by their, uh, by this company. This is called the Invader. It's a four and a quarter inch long, five sixteenths of an ounce. And this one's an OG Sour. And like I said, that OG Sour color is basically like a green, uh, a watermelon red color. And this thing right here has a lot of action. And uh, as you can see, there's a little hook slot right there. And basically, these little rabbit ears, man, they, they produce so much action. And like I said, you get six. Uh, whenever you get yours in, don't freak out and think, oh my God, they only sent me three because, no, they stacked them on top of each other. That was the first thing I thought when I st first started getting their products. I was like, oh my God, I said, they only sent me three of these things. Not realizing they were stacked on top of each other. Uh, this is another one. This is the OG Sour again. Same thing. So, uh, like I said, I bought a lot of the same colors because, you know, certain colors were on sale. So I figured why not buy two or three of each. Uh, next up is the Cheerio. This is their swim bait. And this one's in purple rain. Uh, four and a quarter inches is long and three eighths of an ounce. Purple rain looks totally different than pimping purple, just so you know. So there's that. And then, uh, and the body on this is basically the shape of a Cheerio. You know, the cereal Cheerios. <laughs> and this one is called a uh, Moonlight Clan. And this is basically their take on like a blue pearl. So I got two packs of those. All right, see now this is their old style of pack and this is how everything usually comes. All right, so this is the Invader and this is one of my favorite colors by them besides the Boss Nugget. All their colors to me are really nice. I like their colors. So really, I can't tell you which one's my favorite. This one is a Royal Irishman. To me, it's almost like a, a smoky gray with purple and uh, purple and gold flakes in it. A real neat color. Got a lot of flake on the back side of it. And that's called Royal Irishman, and that's the Invader. Next up, Invader. This one's in a mustard water. They have weird names for their colors. This one's mustard water, and this one's kind of cool. It's got black and blue flake in it, and it's a real, real light, almost green-yellow color. And on the back side, it's got a lot of uh, gold flake in it, as you can see. Uh, 
Is that the same thing? That's the same thing. Uh, no, I didn't show y'all this one. This is uh, the Boss Nugget and the Invader. This is uh, the Boss Nugget on this is almost like a June bug, but on the their their colors kind of change on certain baits. Like the Boss Nugget on this is like a a June bug. But on that caboose crawl, it was a, a totally different color. So, kind of hard to say. Alright, so next up we got the joystick. This is uh, six inches long by three uh, three eighths of an ounce, and the color of this one is called Cold Cut. And this right here is basically a black and blue with blue flake in it. The black on one side, solid black, and then you flip it to the other side, and it's got that blue glitter. And uh, basically, you'll fish this just like you would a speed worm. Or you could put a, a weighted belly hook on there and swim it through the water. Really good bait. And like I said, all these, I mean, a lot of them are on sale. A lot of them, I mean... Even at four dollars a pack, or still, that's still a good price. But like I said, I didn't pay over like three dollars for mine. Uh, this is uh, the joystick again, and this is in uh, Floranto Lime. Well, I guess I'm taking some out of the pack. This was a really good, like chartreuse, like a chartreuse green. Chartreuse is on the bottom really well. And it's got, it's almost like that, uh, what is that, watermelon black pepper or something with a real chartreuse bottom. But I thought that was really cool. Uh, next up, this one's cool one too. This is a uh, cinnamon toast. And this is like a gold brown, almost see-through. And then on the back, there's a lot of silver going through it. So, I really like that color. That color's kind of nice. Next up is uh, PB and J. but really nice color it's got red and a green flake in it and it's purple on one side and kind of a brownish red on the bottom So this is one that I haven't fished before. I just now noticed they even had these, and these were actually a dollar something a pack. These were the cheapest thing on there. These are called the Big Squirm, and it's a curly tail worm. This is the Royal Irishman. It's 10 inches long and uh, 3 eighths of an ounce. I will take this out to show you, but you can see how big that worm is. Real neat color, black on top with a purple tint to it. 
and then silver on the bottom real real nice curly tail worm uh y'all know with with it getting ready to be the hot part of the year and fish start going deep that's when you start throwing them big worms so i picked me up a bunch of these and like i said for a dollar something a pack you can't beat that and there's uh one two three four five six seven eight there's eight of them in a pack uh this is the joystick og sour this is their small one this is the five inch the other one for a six inch and like i said y'all have already seen the og sour color uh here's another one this is a uh, pimpin purple in the joystick Real good looking color. And like I said, just get on Amazon and don't go by the prices that they show on the, on the picture. Click on it and it'll have multiple colors on there and different prices underneath each one. And you select the one you want. Uh, this one was the Royal Irishman and the joystick. Y'all have already seen that. Uh, next up we this is uh, the big squirm and an 8 inch and that's the pimpin purple let me show you all that and basically it's got like a clear on the top a gr uh, pumpkin gr green on the bottom and purple and black flakes real neat color like i said their colors change with each bait so you know your pendant purple on one is totally different on the other i think it's kind of weird but that's just how it is uh this is uh the 10 inch royal irishman big squirm uh oh here it is uh this is uh the witch witch's brew this is the big squirm. This is a real nice, almost a June bug color, but there's a little bit of a difference to it. But basically, if you're looking for like a June bug color, this would be the color to go for. It is a little bit different though. And like I said, these right here got a lot of scent to them. And the big squirm comes in a 10 inch and an 8 inch. And sometimes the 10 inches are cheap and sometimes they're more expensive and by burst the 8 inch might be more. And that was a witch brew too. So. Alright, this is another one of my favorite baits by them. This is the Ninja Worm. Uh, this is five and a half, uh, five and a half inches long by three eighths of an ounce, and this one's in cinnamon toast. This is their uh, version of basically a speed worm. But I like it. It's a, a real beefy profile speed worm. And so you can see this little tail. That tail is going to give all kinds of action. Uh, kind of segmented right there. And like I said, that's a big, beefy profile bait. And then you got your little hook slots. So, real nice bait. And that one, like I said, is called the Ninja Tail Worm. And that color is Cinnamon Toast five and a half inches long and i do believe they have a bigger version of that too next up is uh the big squirm uh pb and j this is the eight inch looks like i got two packages of those
PB and J is a real nice color. It's a purple and brown. Which I guess is why they call it PB and J. PB and J time. Finally, I'm down to the end of the box. Next up is the Ninja Worm. This one's a sweet red chili sauce. And this is a, se a seven inch and seven sixteenths of an ounce. So yeah, they do come in different sizes. This right here is a real nice color. This is a, uh, reminds me of red bug, really. Real nice bait, but that's what it reminds me of is red bug. And like I said, before making this video, I got on Amazon to make sure everything was still on sale. And it still is. So, like I said, you just got to look through them and find the colors that are on sale. Next up is the Ninja Worm Ninja Tail. This is the five and a half inch. And this one's Royal Irishman. fix these tails on this thing but anyways the royal irishman real neat color if y'all don't know by now y'all know now that z-man and 13 fishing is probably one of my favorite companies other than uh, Thunderhawk baits, I do love their stuff, but I do have favorites just like anybody else. This is uh, this is the cold cut and the Ninja Tail Worm. I'm going to show you all this. I really like this. Like I said, it's a black on the top blue on the bottom or however they're basically double laminated i guess is what you call it it's a two-tone injection and like i said these ain't sample packs there's nothing wrong with them they're just like i said i think they're colors that didn't sell very well this one right here is uh, called the Skittle Forks. I've had this one before. Works really good. So I had to buy me another pack since they were on sale. This one's almost like a red bug too as well. But it's just a little bit different. I think that chili, that red chilies is more of a red bug than this. This is a little bit lighter of a tint. But anyways, real nice color. All right, y'all. Well, that is uh, the end of the video. And like I said, I got more coming. So there'll probably be a part two to this. If not, y'all have got the idea. I basically just wanted to share with y'all that. That way, maybe y'all can get on Amazon and get y'all some baits for cheap. Especially for those of y'all that, that like 13 fishing. Y'all know their stuff's expensive. And uh, those of y'all that might be wanting to try 13 fishing, like I said, they got them on there but from a dollar to three dollars to four dollars and on up. So go check them out. Like I said, don't go by the price that they show on the picture. Just click on it and look through all the colors and then you know, pick out the one that you want and it'll show you the price and you'll find them. So anyways, thank y'all for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Sorry it was so long, but we all like looking at baits. So anyways, I'll see y'all on the next one and have a great night.